Hi everyone, welcome back for another tutorial. In this tutorial I want to show you how to add a watermark using Lightroom. A lot of people, people have been asking me this question, so here I am doing a tutorial for that. So, first things first, let's go to Edit and Edit Watermarks. Right here you have some options, so this option right here, the first one that gives you by default, is using a text. So, at this moment in time I've got copyright, so if I click here, I'll just put the L just for the fun of it, like so. And as you can see, updated right here. Now we have the option also to change the font and the style of the font. And if we can align left, center, right, and color, we can resize it as well. And we've got other options right here shadow, opacity. You get the idea. It's just something that you need to play with. As you can see, you can just move it around. Cool. What if you want to add? Uh, a graphic, let's say your logo or your own signature. So for that we need to create one. So I'm going to cancel this for time being and I'm going to Photoshop. So I'm just going to create a new file, like so, new document. And it's very important to do this. It's create a new blank layer straight away. The reason is I want to save the transparency of this graphic. So with the brush tool selected I'm just going to grab my pen and like so and there you go cool so now i'll just grab my crop tool because i don't need that to be that big so something like so and crop it a bit more like this and i'm good to go so now i need to hide background layer or i can delete it and i'm going to file export and put quick export as a png so I'm just going to call it watermark, watermark, like so, and save. And that's it. Now back to Lightroom, and under the edit menu, we've got edit watermarks just like before, and now we've got the option here, graphic, and I'm just going to find my watermark right here. So I'll click choose, and I've got it here. And as you can see, it's here. So I'm just going to put it like this, and now I want to save it. As you can see, we, which you can change size, the anchor point, just like before. So I'm just going to put like this and just make it a bit smaller. At least you can see what I'm doing. And I'm going to save. And I'm going to save and I'm going to call it tutorial. There you go. And create. And that's it. Job done. So now all you have to do is when you're exporting one image or multiple images, go to File, Export, and right here you've got, uh, like here, you've got watermark, simply, simple copyright watermark or tutorial, like this. Make sure you are exporting as a JPEG, because if you are exporting as a DNG, you won't be able to apply a watermark on it. So I'm just going to make sure this goes to my desktop, yes, Export. Job done, and minimize this, and here we are. We've got my watermark. That's it for now. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Don't forget to share this video, subscribe, share with your friends, family, and even to people you don't know. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.